This group may be small, but its mission is huge. It's easy for them to go unnoticed among the thousands of tourists in St. Peter's Square. But even so, for the last five years, this small group has organized a procession in Rome to pray for the church in China. Our brothers in China may not be here, but they are joining this procession through their suffering, through trials and tribulations. This pilgrimage is a way to unite. It's a small sacrifice to help us rediscover that we are walking together toward Christ. It's a way to entrust to Our Lady the evangelization of China. The procession is held every 24th of May, which is actually the day Benedict XVI dedicated to pray for the church in China. On that day, a very popular image of Our Lady is celebrated in the sanctuary of Shishan in Shanghai. In Rome, she's venerated with a procession from St. Peter's Square to the Basilica of St. Mary Major, where Cardinal Julian Herranz celebrates Mass. We are in the month of May, which is the month of the Virgin Mary, so it's important for us to be here in Rome and lead a procession to St. Mary Major to pray at her feet and together with the successor of St. Peter and trust her with our prayer. The situation of Christians in China isn't always easy. In fact, some of them have left the country altogether. So this group is focused on strengthening the faith of Chinese Christians wherever they may be. China Prayer Group. The group is called China Prayer, which came about under the new evangelization. It's a group of prayer and ministry for Chinese in China, or even for Chinese who migrate to other countries, which is quite common. And so, even though the group is small, its initiative is powerful. Step by step, it tries to bring the new evangelization to the East.